Have you ever wondered about the importance of rites of passage in different cultures? How these ceremonies signify a transformative stage in a person's life? In this short video I will delve into the fascinating journey of the Bratabanda ceremony, a profound rite of passage in Hindu culture, particularly in Nepal. I was invited to join this ceremony, I offered to make pictures and videos for this family, so they can always look back at this special day. It was special to be there the entire day and witness this ceremony. Although it was a long day, it was more than worth it. I learned so many new things as well. From the early morning until the late afternoon, every moment something else was going on. So many things to experience and so many beautiful moments to capture. In Nepal, Bratabanda carries enhanced cultural weight amidst the dominant Hindu population. The extensive rituals connect present citizens to ancestral heritage, conferring identity within the ancient caste system through the wearing of the eponymous sacred Janai threads diagonally crossing the chest. Beyond just familial celebration, communities recognize the oaths of devotion to learning, faith and dignity. Boys take becoming grown men who shall lead households and perpetuate traditions into the future. Bratabanda is a time-honored tradition marking a young boy's transition into manhood. This ceremony typically takes place when the boy is around eight or nine years old. In this case, both brothers were older, 14 and 18 years old. During the Bratabanda ceremony, the young boy is initiated into the study of the Vedas and other sacred texts. The ceremony typically involves a series of rituals conducted by a priest, including the cutting of the boy's hair, the wearing of a sacred thread, known as Janai or Yajnopavita, and the recitation of Vedic hymns and prayers. This thread, woven from cotton or silk, is comprised of three strands, each representing a deity in the Hindu trinity, Brahma, Vishnu and Shiva. The thread, worn over the left shoulder and under the right arm, embodies the boy's commitment to his faith and spiritual journey. The main ceremony, conducted under the watchful eyes of a priest or religious leader, is steeped in sacred rituals. Mantras echo through the air as prayers ascend heavenwards, seeking divine blessings. The boys, now the focal point of the ceremony, adheres to specific rituals and practices. These include observing celibacy and abstaining from certain foods, all part of his newfound spiritual discipline. Upon completion of the Bratabanda ceremony, the boys attains the status of a Dvija or twice-born. From this moment onwards, they are expected to uphold the responsibilities of a Hindu householder. This ceremony, deeply entwined with Hindu culture, is a joyous occasion, celebrated with fervor by the family and community. So, why is the Bratabanda ceremony done? This traditional rite of passage has both spiritual and cultural significance. On a spiritual level, it reaffirms the boy's commitment to his faith, setting him on the path of Dharma or righteousness. Culturally, it marks his symbolic entry into adult society, preparing him to shoulder the responsibilities of a Hindu householder. The Bratabanda ceremony is also a time to honor the gods and seek their blessings for the boy's future. It provides an opportunity for the boys to receive guidance and wisdom from their elders and learn about the principles and values that underpin Hindu culture. In summary, the Bratabanda ceremony is a pivotal event in a young boy's life. It marks his transition into adulthood and the acceptance of new responsibilities, both spiritual and cultural. It's a time of transformation, a celebration of life and growth, an essential part of the rich tapestry of Hindu culture. So the next time you witness this fascinating rite of passage, you'll appreciate the depth and significance that the Bratabanda ceremony holds in many Hindu communities, particularly in Nepal. Let's celebrate the beauty and significance of Bratabanda honoring the traditions that connect us to our roots and shape our path forward.